Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Jinto from your Swigget store bringing you another video review of the David Warner series. As I mentioned in my live video, the, the series that is dedicated for David Warner is called as Crunch. So Crunch is the name of the series. We'll be doing individual reviews on all the grades that is available and the grades are as follows. Crunch Pro is the grade one offering. Then we have Crunch 1.0 and uh, 2.0, which is the grade two offering. Then we have Crunch 3.0, 5.0, 7.0 is the grade 3 offering and finally we have the crunch 9.0 which is the grade 5 offering well with that said today with me i have the crunch pro which is the grade 1 offering and sits right below the play edition clefs that is available with dsc what is changed with respect to the profile from the play edition bat if you ask me that question the answer to that question would be very, very simple. Absolutely nothing. So it's just that the difference in the cleft that is selected for the play edition versus if this is a normal grade one cleft that has been selected by DSC for preparing this Crunch Pro. Well, with respect to the decals, again, it's absolutely nothing changes with respect to the decals. You would not see the laser engraving here of the Bull 31, which is the David Warner Play Edition series name, but you instead you will see the sticker for Crunch Pro and at the back as well, Crunch Pro. But this particular bad guys is an indeed gem. I'll tell you why. Just take a look at these grains, guys. This is like nine grains, straight parallel equidistant grains. And the, the good part is it's straight parallel equidistant on the back as well. It's seriously, it's, it's, in, it's a straight parallel equidistant at the toe as well. Well, you know, it, it's like it's like it's tailor made for someone really, really lucky. Uh, I would say, in my opinion. Well, um, this how the bat is. The profile is as follows. If you see that, and if you've seen my live video, or if you see the play edition uh, video that we launched at uh, the YouTube channel, you would see that the profile is exactly the same. A lovely extended profile with the duck bill toe feature right here and at the same time very very thick thick edges guys we're looking at 42 mm on the edge and a 64 on the spine with a 29 mm on the toe and as i have been saying in my videos that there is no scalloping done on the upper part of the bat it's a very very full bat guys and again one more thing i really really love is the ovalness of the handle i really like my bat to be handles to be this oval so that it does not slip in my hands when I'm trying to go for my expansive shots and you know I get full value for my shots even if the ball hits off center on my bat right so see here this here's this here's the thing right so if you observe carefully again it's the oval shape here and this handles is slightly slimmer than the play edition bat that's something that you would have to keep in mind so if it was being purchased by me i would certainly put another grip on top of it to make it even more balanced uh, guys so this is the three rubber inserts and the handle quality is exactly the same the grip quality is exactly the same there is no difference in the grips uh, uh, between this one and the play edition but it's exactly the same the shoulders are thick you know the giving you the balanced feel in your hands when you're trying to pick up the bat again guys so you heard the specs the specs are humongous but let me give you the 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 response or the balance feel in my opinion the weight of this particular bat is only 2.9.1 on the scales but in my hands it definitely feels much much more lighter guys really really feels like a 2.8 max if i want to be really harsh or critical 2.8 at the max but again guys this is a lovely lovely looking bat the decals are i mean embossed textured and if you see that there's a pimple effect at the bottom of the screen bottom of the decals right at the up top as well and even at the bottom there is a pimple effect at the bottom here which does not exist in the other dsc bats uh, or other dsc play edition bats that we have in stock well guys you heard it from the person who or from the from the guys who have it in stock uh, and then these are lovely, lovely bats, which I think you would not find it that often in the market today. Well, with that said, let's check out the ping of this bat now, which is the most important factor in for any cricket bat. Lovely, lovely bow, isn't it? So let's check out the ping. There it is, guys. 
the pressing, the pressing, pressing. This is what this is what DSC is actually known for, the pressing, guys. Now this this see this is this is it. If I want to show you the show you the ping, right? There is the ping, guys. It's it's like a springy response, right? Like trampoline. That's how beautifully pressed these bats are, really, and hardly any seam marks on the bat. You know, I mean, pressing it to almost to the perfection point, which will give you the optimum performance, is I would say the way to go, guys. Retail price of this Crunch Pro is six hundred twenty-nine dollars and ninety-nine cents. I would be leaving the link of uh, the the to purchase this particular bat in the description of this video and we have more bats in the crunch pro series crunch series and the pro version uh, which is the grade one offering from dsc in the david warner profile uh, you can reach out to us if you have any questions we'll be more than happy to answer and get the right bat for you as per your playing style and preference well if you like the content that we host on our channel then would request to sub please smash that subscribe button otherwise it's all good, guys. Until next time, this is Jinto signing off from US Cricket Store. Redefine cricket in US.